Hello everybody, I'm VTV, you're watching Variety Television, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. Uh, we got a letter here, it says, Dear Farmer VTV, but I believe we read this one last time. Yeah, it's about the uh, house upgrade where we could get a kitchen. I, uh, I picked these already in the last episode, but I didn't say, or I, yeah, 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 I didn't save that once it was done, so... It is now undone. I have 40, 40 gold, and I can, I'm definitely. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold the phone. Before anything, before I decide on anything that I'm doing, I'm actually gonna go and check the calendar and check the daily request. I think that's the main thing that uh. But I want to get done. I have a craving for anchovy. I I would accept it, but I ha I don't have an anchovy. I could go try to catch one. I could make that the goal for the day, catching catching uh, Linus and anchovy. That could be interesting. I'm gonna check my skills. My fishing is is plus one fishing rod efficiency okay cool i'm busy can't you tell all rude okay here we are at the beach and i am gonna get myself into a spot of fishing hello good sir if you purchase a high quality fishing rod you'll be able to attach bait and tackle to the line Bait causes fish to bite faster. Tackle can make your job a lot easier when reeling fish in. Cool. Boom. Let's try and catch a sardine for Linus. Oh. Oh, come on. Thank you. Anchovy. Not what we're looking for. Sardine. Sardine. That's what we were looking for, right? Okay. Alright, I'm gonna sell the anchovy for 30 gold. And I'm gonna just go give this... This, uh, sardine to Linus. What else am I gonna do with it, you know? I may as well accept the quest. I'll probably, honestly, I bet I will get more gold for it, doing it this way. Maybe not. But... Uh, it'll make Linus like me more, so that's cool. A uh, big part of this game is uh, building up your relationships with everybody in the town. Oh, and I forgot to check the calendar. It's Haley's birthday today. Anchovy. Wait, no. I did the wrong thing. I kept the... I thought he wanted a sardine. I had to go back and buy back that anchovy. Crap, dude. Well, actually, I don't want to waste the gold and buy it back. I'll just catch another one and then sell him the sardine that I have. Hopefully, I'll catch another anchovy. There we go. Finally got an anchovy. I caught three sardines that I can sell to this guy. For 120 gold. That's very nice. I can use that to buy some sort of seed or another. Or something. Maybe I'll just save it for now because I, I already have a lot of crops to water. I haven't decided yet, but we do got to go get this, uh, this anchovy to Linus. Here we are. Oh, you brought me the item I asked for. Thanks so much. Let's see. Here's what I owe you. Alright, so we can just collect that. Nice. Okay, you know, one of the things we could do, it says, is to build a coop, right? So we could make that our next objective. Because it's a thing we could do. So let's go up here. You are who I talked to about it, right? A coop. It's 4,000 gold, 300 wood, and 100 stone. Okay. Oh, whoa. I didn't know you could buy stuff like this. Calendar. 
workbench. Ooh, telephone to check store hours and inventory. Budget, dude, dude, there's so much cool stuff you can buy. Whoa, man, these are so cool. All right, well, we gotta check out some of this stuff once we have a bit more money. There's some like really, really cool furniture options in there. But for now, I only have 280 gold. I want to try and find Haley to give her something for her birthday. I have no idea on earth what she would want. Um, so I think I'm just going to give her one of the cauliflower that I have. She'll probably... Can I get to that pink flower right there by chance? Is that at all? Yes, but I can't pick it. Okay, that's all I wanted to know. Now, where might Haley be? It never rains in Calico Desert. That's where my friend Sandy lives. Your friend Sandy lives in the desert? I wish I could have visit her, visited her today. Maybe I should cook something new and exciting today. Something spicy. I don't know, maybe you could. You want one of these? This is a really nice gift. Thank you. Oh, you're oh, you're very welcome. Um maybe that maybe maybe she's in here. Welcome. Hello Gus. Good evening. It's er, <laughs> Gus Lewis. <laughs> Good evening, it's nice to see you socializing with the townsfolk. It's good to stop by once in a while and see what the latest news is. I'm not trying to buy any of this stuff. Um, I'm looking for Haley. I'd imagine she's somewhere around here. Somewhere. Where would Haley be on her birthday? Like, where's the place to go on Haley's birthday? It seems like everybody's going there, though. Maybe she ev eventually, too, will go there. I'm gonna go check her house again, though. One of these houses, I think. Man, I feel like I've been everywhere. All I can do is keep checking the same places over and over again. Locked. So does everybody lock their house up at 8? Where is this girl, dude? That sucks, but I guess I'm not going to be able to give Haley anything for her birthday because, um, well, it's midnight now. Oh, our farming has leveled up. We have a plus one watering can proficiency, plus one hoe proficiency, new crafting recipe for a stone fence, new crafting recipe for a mayonnaise machine, and a new crafting recipe for a sprinkler. We're mining level two. We can now craft a staircase. That's pretty cool. And we got 1,209 gold from the day's harvest and foraging, which is not bad, I would say. It does suck we were unable to give Haley anything for her birthday, though. I would have liked to be able to do that. What's this on about? Hello, dear. I know you're just getting started as a gardener, so I wanted to give you a little tip. Most crops only grow in one season. When summer arrives, your spring crops will all die out. So plan ahead. Granny Evelyn. Dude, I'm not calling you Granny. Get over yourself. What is that? Oh, a parsnip. Whenever these things are ready to harvest, that's going to be a good, good day for money. Oh, our beans are ready. I think I'm going to sell all of it and just start trying to get ready for the, like, next big harvest, right? I also want to start, I think, getting copper together so that I can upgrade tools. This is what I'm going to bring with me for now. Now, after watering everything, I still have a decent chunk of energy. I also have 1,489 gold. While I could very well... Hold on. Let's see what we have going on. What are the upcoming events? The next most upcomingest event is Pam's birthday in a few days. 
I'm trying to keep the art of fishing alive. I'll pay 90 gold to any fishing enthusiast who catches three herring. Good luck. I don't know where to catch herring. Should I accept it and like, and just go look for herring? Hi. Oh, did you want something? Just trying to talk, that's all. Let's head over to the blacksmith shop and have him crack open these geodes for us. But first, let's try for a herring. Okay, I actually landed something. Let's see what we got. Let's see if it's a herring. Oh, I don't know, but I got that treasure chest. Now I just have to catch the fish. All right, dude. It is a record sunfish, and what's in the chest? It's a geode, right when we're on the way to the blacksmith shop. That's awesome. It's funny how things work out like that sometimes. Uh, process geodes. Boom. What was that? A thunder egg. Earth crystal. Limestone. Cool. Oh, I can buy coal from him. But also, like, it's pretty... Like, it's pretty common, right? I don't really need to buy it, because I can go mine it myself, you know? The trees look nice today, don't they? So why did you become a farmer? I want to make tons of money. It's more real than living in the city. I would follow my grandpa's footsteps. I wanted to escape my old life. Um... Based on what I saw in the opening, I would say it would be either the second option or the fourth option. But I'm going to go with the second option. That's pretty much the reason I came here, too. Cool. Um, this person won't speak. Thanks. This looks nice. They still will not speak. All right. Well, there's not much can be done there. Oops. Hmm. I'm wondering if I'm just looking in the wrong area for herring. The wrong area for herring. I don't know, but I'm going to collect these items that are here on the beach. Washed up, a mussel and a clam. Catch this seagull. Ah, uh, he was too fast. What's up, Elliot? I'm kind of new to this town myself, but I really feel at home. I remembered his name. You proud of me? Let's see. Maybe if I go out to the farthest... Oh, wait. I want to try, like, right here, because that, that area right there looks very deep. There could be something good there. Let's see. A sardine! Alright, that was easy. A herring! We got it! Wait, don't I need to catch three of those? I think it said I need to catch three of those. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Sardine. Come on, herring. Come on, herring. Come on, herring. Come on, herring. Be a herring. It was easy. It's a good sign. Sardine. Oh, right back down, and back up again, and down and up. What is this thing, dude? It's so freaking evasive. All right, I might, I, I, I might, ah, uh, stop pressing the button. Okay. What is that? Flounder. I have not caught a flounder before. I'm gonna have to hang on to that guy. One thing I want to start doing is like keeping one of each item, because so many people have requests for items 
all the time and I always have to go hunt for them. But if I start keeping at least one of each thing that I find, I have a better chance, I think, of being able to fill more requests. Where it could be good to sell the fish, it could also be really good to keep at least one of them, you know, for for quest purposes, gift purposes. Come on, give me a herring. Sardine. Are herrings just, like, more rare? I may just be fishing at the wrong time now. It may be too late in the day to catch herring off this pier. Mm -hmm. We'll try for one more. Oh my god, no. <laughs> that one was really hard. I don't know what that was. Mm -hmm. I said I would try for one more, but I'm going to do it again. Because I didn't catch anything. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, he's starting to be evasive. Come on, come on. There we go. What is it? Halibut. Okay. Just for the halibut, am I right? Okay, hold on, hold on. What's this? Oh, no, 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 no. I really want it. 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 Please, 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 please. Yes. Herring. Yes! Is this a herring hole? Is this, uh, the bubbles? Is it a herring hole? Ah, I messed it up. Seaweed? No. Hold on. It's not too late for herring, so I'm gonna keep going. I'm starting to feel exhausted. I can't fish too much longer, and I missed the bubbles. God! Alright. Okay, but, alright, that lets me know. This is my last fish. Okay, and then I'm really, for real, going home. Because I caught two herring and I only need three. I only need three. Yes! Alright, we did it. Alright, I need to get back up there and accept that quest before it goes away. Right? Because it, it stays up there, I assume, until midnight. That's Linus. Poor man, digging through the can. Grr, sounds like those raccoons are back again, filthy varmints. Linus is not a raccoon. Ah, you turned up at the right t Ah, whoa. Ah, you turned up at the right moment, miss. Could you do an old man a favor? Could you go around the corner and scare off those raccoons for me? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks. Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. It was me. I'm sorry. I find a lot of hot fresh food in these cans. Stuff that will go to waste if I don't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? I could say, yes it's disgusting, no it's a shame for food to go to waste, yes it's illegal, that's Georgia's private property, no but you should get a job and stop leeching off of others. What a terrible thing to say. I'm gonna say no it's a shame for food to go to waste because the man is just trying to survive. Thanks, VCV. I knew you were an open-minded person. I feel good about what I'm doing. I am not harming anyone. You can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's can anymore. You can tell him you scared off the raccoons for good. George can screw off. Wait. I know what you were doing, Linus. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican Town to go hungry. Here, I got a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in my spicy marinara. Go on, take it. Alright, well... 
that was very nice of um Gus to give Linus those that food. And if we ever get some extra food, we gotta make sure to give it to Linus as well. Oh wait, 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 wait. I almost went home. I need to go to this board. Three herring. Yes. Ninety gold. Oh, and I get to keep the fish. Okay, okay. So I can still sell him the herring. That's good. Alright. And I might level up for all that fishing I did. That would be pretty good. I did get level 2 fishing. I can craft bait. 900 gold. Alright, that's a lot more than I was expecting, honestly. I somehow forgot um, about the cauliflower. And we're at 2,314 gold. That's pretty good. Dear VTV, have you settled into your new life yet? I can't believe you're all grown up now. Time sure flies. Now that you're gone, I have all this extra money lying around, so I included a little gift. Love, Dad. 500 gold enclosed. Yo, thanks, Dad. Dear neighbor, I hope you are feeling settled in your new home. I am writing to let you know that Pierre's store is now selling fertilizers. Why don't you swing by and see if you can afford a few dozen boxes or so? Pierre. Alright, so our dad gave us... Oops. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Um, Alright, we need to go do that. And it's raining again, but we can pick our parsnips. Alright. I'm going to put one in the box. Or one in the chest and the rest in the sale box. Right? Yeah. And we're going to take the rest of the stuff that we have, like the uh, stone things, like the minerals or whatever, to the museum. We're going to take those herring to Willy. And that's going to be really good. And I'm going to go... That's something I think, I think that's, I'm almost positive that's something I can dig up. So I'm going to go back, like the trilobite, I'm going to go back and get the hoe. So we can dig that up. Oh, it was just some clay. Well, it was some clay I didn't have before, I guess. Let's see what we have. There's no new, re no new requests for the day. And we are two days away from Pam's birthday. Um... The first thing I want to do is go find Willy, I think. And I will assume he's at his fish store. Which could uh, pose a problem, actually. Because I don't know if I can get behind the counter at his fish store. You know? I don't know if these salmon berries are worth anything, man. But uh, I'm pretty sure doing that increases my foraging. So, may as well. Oh, look, there's another thing here. Good thing I decided to bring the hoe. What is that? A lost book? You found a lost book. The library's collection has expanded. Whoa, that is pretty cool. I'll have to go check that out. Do I still have the lost book? Like, in my inventory? No. Okay, it just increases the library's collection. That's pretty neat, dude. Not even gonna lie. Oh, look, look, look. There's Willy. Um, a true angler. No, dude. It was... <sighs> I have to catch more herring. He thought that herring was a gift, but it was in fact a herring that I was trying to give to him for his request. But I guess it, it wasn't a stack of three herrings, so it didn't count or something stupid like that. Alright, alright, alright. Herring. Three. And a gold star sardine. Good. Good, 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 good. Good. Excellent. Um, sir. Dude, was it not Willy? One out of three herring caught? Oh my god. I had to accept it first and... Oh my god. Oh my god. If I had known that, I thought I had to catch them and then give it to him like all the other freaking requests.
Jeez. I've caught so many herrings. I'm gonna go into the herring hole, dude. There's always herrings at the herring hole. Anchovy. Come on, herring. Come out of your herring hole. Sardine. The ocean is best enjoyed alone, don't you think? Well, excuse me, sir. Just head back to my herring hole. Let me check the fish store and see if I can buy a better fishing pole. I can, I can. For 1,800. Dude, I'm gonna go ahead and get that. Because it might make catching these a lot easier. 20. Yes. Oh, wait. That was 19. 20. There we go. Okay. I figured it out. Alright. Let's see if we can find some herring, dude. I got a fiberglass rod now. Nothing is gonna stop me. Sardine. What do we got? Fucking sardine. What? What's even? Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Ah. Wait, that was freaking crazy, dude. What was that? It, like, bit immediately and then jumped straight up. Oh, look, it's another one. Hold on, I really want this. I really... Come on, come on. I really want this. That's so such a strange behavior. What kind of fish is this? An eel. I got a new achievement, fisherman. Dude, an eel? That's awesome. I'm buying the fish tank for this eel. I hope you know I hope you all know this. I'm going to be a person who owns a fish tank with an eel in it. Ah, I pressed the button too early. Gosh, dang it. Nice. Oh, a gold star eel. There's a little bubble piece right there, I'm pretty sure. It could be rain. Could just be the rain hitting the water, but it looks like a bubble piece. Herring. That's two. That's two. I just need to catch one more. Please. Please let me catch one more herring. I'm begging. For one more herring. Good. Herring. Yes! Ah, that's all I needed. Okay. Okay. Now, let me double check. Return to Willy. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. The herring quest is completed. Let's go talk to this man. Move. Hey, you succeeded, VTV. The herring is an exciting catch, don't you think? They're always hiding in the most peculiar places. Well, here's your reward. Congratulations. Thank you. Alright. It's time to go put these other ones up. And sell the ones that I caught to try and and pay off this fishing pole. This $2,000 fishing pole that I purchased. I'm, I'm slowly getting towards 4000 for that coop. Don't forget. That's what we set out to do initially, and I, I, it's still in the back of my mind. We are now at level 3 of fishing. Plus 1 fishing rod proficiency. We can craft a crab pot, which is pretty sick. And we can uh, cook a dish of the, dish of the sea once we get a kitchen. Alright, so we got 506 for the parsnips, 102 for foraging, 743 for fishing, 40 for other, for a grand total, 1,391. Almost what I spent on that fishing pole. Almost. Alright. Ah, of course, we have to collect our 90 gold. So, we still have the quest to reach level 40 in the mines. We still have the quest to build a coop, which is currently what I'm working on. Raising enough money to, in fact, build a coop. But, unfortunately, that's all the time we have for today. So, I really do hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, consider leaving a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to keep up with this series. Uh, if you've watched it this far, then um, you probably would want to keep up with it. And it's going to continue. Um, comment any tips you have down below. I would really, really appreciate tips because, as I said in the first episode, this is still my first playthrough of Stardew Valley and I'm still learning the ropes. So any comments of any tips would be 
greatly, greatly appreciated. Um, I really hope to see you guys in the next episode, but until then, goodbye. Thank you.